Welcome back to 3Sport. Today we'll, we'll take a look at one of my more favorite drills to warm up with here. Okay, so it's gonna be really simple for anyone. It's gonna be the high T drill. So when I say high T, I don't mean absolutely crazy out of the zone. I just mean right about at the belly button of the hitter or top of the strike zone for most ages. Okay, so for we're gonna work it about right there. We're not gonna put it too far outside, okay? We don't want the bat to work away from us. We want it more on the inner side of the plate. All he's gonna do is set up regular. We're gonna have his left hand or non-hitting hand for this drill under the armpit. And what that's doing is keeping our shoulders a little more square, okay? You'll see guys that do it like this, they like to rip their shoulder open and then we get that barrel working sideways and we don't want the barrel to work away from our head, okay? So all he's gonna do is take a nice, easy load and take a nice swing through the ball with one hand. That was pretty good, okay? So one thing to kind of watch on this drill, and this goes for other drills as well in the cage, it's okay to not completely finish your swing here. And what I mean by that is it's okay to finish with palm up. So a lot of the stuff that we wanna do is with that palm up finish. So if he's able to finish there, we know that he could stay there in the game, okay? So we just don't wanna roll that wrist over too soon. So we're really focusing on keeping his palm working through the baseball and up the whole time that it's in the zone. So he'll take another swing here. Okay, and you can see he's getting a nice step in. This is a drill that, one, if you're a guy that likes to drift, I like to put you in post stride as we call it, or no load, okay? So you're just loading your legs and then you're working your hands. If we have good hands, we usually have a pretty good chance to hit. And as long as there's a somewhat of a solid base, then your head won't be moving too much. So he's gonna take one more, try to keep his palm up as long as he can through the baseball. Good. Okay. Uh, this is an, another drill that you can do one on the T. Um, if you don't wanna do the T, make sure someone when they're feeding you is flipping the ball a little bit higher to you because you don't want to be chopping down at the baseball with one hand. 